Yo, 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 guys, yo, guys, it is Old Man G here back again with another video for Red Devil Studio. Um, and Jaden Sancho to United, um, deal close. But if you're new to the channel, to like, share, and subscribe to Red Devil Studio, follow us on Twitter, United as X, smash the notification button for latest Manchester United news. We're also going to be doing some Euro stuff from next week, so stay tuned for that as well, as well as some reactions from the Euro's tournament. But anyway, um, Jaden Sancho to United deal close. Now I've been um, not wanting to do this just predominantly because I want to hear from more reliable sources and and all the rest of it, and just with everything that's going on in the club. But I thought with forbids to mind of actually doing a tweet, uh, an informed tweet today, um, and he said a couple of days back that he was going to drop some, some some news on it. So in his Instagram. Basically, and just go for it, he's essentially said this. He says, Manchester United main target is Jaden Sancho, and they're working on the deal again. Okay, that's number, point number one. Point number two, he says, at Manchester United have now restarted contacts to sign Jaden Sancho, direct talks to players camp on personal terms. Now, we know that personal terms and Jaden Sancho have been agreed before. That's been sorted. There's no issue with that. Potential contract, okay, maybe this is the new information here, until 2026 and salary as one year ago to be confirmed as manual proposal. Agent's fee has never been issued. So personal terms, contract, all those issues are fine. But here is the kicker. Here is the kicker. No official bid to Borussia Dortmund yet, but Man United are planning to try again with Sanch after being one step away from signing last summer. It's going to be discussed. I'll talk to players come to Manchester United board. Well, you know, the one step away was that we couldn't negotiate a fee. That was the one step away. The one step away was that we couldn't negotiate a fee. Everything was place, but we couldn't negotiate a fee. That, that's always been the issue of this football club. Stingy. Um, Borussia Dortmund have an agreement with Sancho to let him leave this summer, but only in the case the right bid will arrive. Price tag around 90 to 95 million euro and not 100 to as one year ago. So, okay, they've now we've now got um, a hun a, essentially about 20 million, 25, well, about 30 million euros less than last. So, I guess fair play to the club in that respect. Um, but clearly, the club seem to be wanting to barter. Um, for something like 77 million pounds, so it's probably about 80 million or something like that. Um, uh, pounds and obviously dormant are, are not budging right now. Um, Liverpool have not opened talks for Jaden despite rumors weeks ago. No bid or come to Liverpool as of day, so Liverpool aren't interested right now. And then, lastly, to be clear, it's not a done deal or set to be completed yet. Manuel C are just back on Sandra's top target, and let's see what happens. So, is that much? Not particularly. Um, so, in summary, United are in for Sancho. Sancho, personal terms agreed. Contracts are fine. Salaries fine. The big issue, like it was last summer, is can we agree a fee for Jaden Sancho Dortmund? And the big difference is that unlike last season, where it was 120, Dortmund are willing to part ways with Jaden Sancho for around 95 million, which would probably put him as our most expensive um signing i think i think i think pogba was more expensive if i am i correct so definitely a more expensive signing but we will see what happens um and i suspect um this is going to drag on all summer as it usually does with this football club anyway guys if you should channel to like share, and subscribe to red devil studio force on twitter and x smash the notification button to play this manchester Arsenal news leave me your thoughts and comments below have a nice day guys and cheers